and take good care of this young man. When you come back, you will be speaking Thai like a native, huh? Yes. <laughs> and I want to thank you once again, Father. Thank you again. That's really wonderful news. Mm hmm All right. Bye. That was Papa Fung. He would like to see you first thing. Okay. And... And what? You are looking at the first foreign lawyer ever approved as a trial attorney in Thailand. Oh, honey. <laughs> that is great. Congratulations. You did it. So now I can retire. You wish. I'll tell you what, though. Mm -hmm. If you ever find yourself on the wrong side of the law, I'll give you some cheap advice. Oh, cheap, not free, <laughs> just cheap, huh? Hey, you know, a girl's got to earn a living. Speaking of which, you gonna be a good boy while I'm home? Oh, honey. How long are you gonna be away? Mm, you just behind yourself. to an old man. Come. You know why I asked you here? I think so. You're the correct choice. I'm certain of it. Father Cheng is your son. I would completely understand stop, if stop, you... Stop, stop, stop. The matter is settled. <laughs> Chang has no place in the company that your father and I labored to build. I will not allow Chang to 
turned Bangkok mercantile into some kind of cover for his drugs and prostitution and whatever else he's, he's involved in. You know his latest amusement? Death fights. Human fights. And all for the amusement of his clientele. And all for the silent approval of the police. Sickness me. Did he know of your decision? Yes. And? And. In time, he will learn to accept it. Father, I am honored. It's ready, and you can pick it up at my place tonight. Your place? Jack, don't be a stick. It's strictly business. Look, they'll drop off the contract at 6. Then I have to bring it back to Morrison's tomorrow. Okay. Excuse me. Am I interrupting something? Well, as a matter of fact, you are. So, Noi, closing a big deal or zipping one up? Either way, it's a big one. I'll speak to you later. Well, well. So, is there an actual purpose to this visit? Dear Brother Jack, let me be the first to congratulate you. You'll make an excellent chair. Thank you. <laughs> you know, Chang, I didn't really ask for this position, but... But you wanted it. Just remember, Jack, today, it's you. Tomorrow, Yeah! 
There is something I want to show you. These are the best. I've sold these all over the world. Have a look. Are you telling me that all this is available? <laughs> we have an unlimited supply of them. And if I order, how soon can you deliver? Well, you make the payment, and you'll have it. No, respect man. Good fight. Let's go upstairs. Iron, I am going to make you the most renowned black master of martial arts the world has ever seen. I've set up a fight, which you will win. But, fame and fortune have their price. A price I am prepared to pay, sir. Good. It was not the magic fingers that they were after. to be a reason. Oh, come on, I don't know. Welcome back, Chris. Would you care for some drinks? I think we need some champagne. He did it, didn't he? <laughs> Fung made you chairman. Oh, baby, I am so happy for you. It couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. What about Chang? How do you handle it? Well, I don't think he quite understands that it wasn't me, that it was the full board's decision. Well, I guess he's just gonna have to learn to live with it, isn't he? Yeah, I don't think it's that simple. Listen to me, mister. I'm responsible for everyone. It is not your fault, okay? Now, we have some celebrating to do. Give us a kiss. Thank you, 
Ah, Manson! Some party. Are you ready for that surprise? I hope you won't disappoint me this time. He's a shit boxer. Shit boxer? Cola, oblige the gentleman. So what are you saying? You don't want kids ever? Oh, come on, it's not forever, just not now. You know, there's kind of a statute of limitations on something like this. You can't just decide suddenly when I'm 82 years old that you're ready. It might be a little late. Yeah, we will, we will. I'm just not ready, just not now. Is it your parents, is, is that? This world. I mean, just this morning, I'm driving in the garage. There's three guys trying to mug a poor old lady. And what you're thinking of? I mean, because it's not going to happen to us. The same thing's not going to happen Come again. Come on, it's not that. Well, then what? I don't know. What do you want, Jack? What do you really want? I don't know. I'm hungry. or shit boxing Manson. Perhaps you need a little more preparation. some shit. Come on. We have better things to talk about. I assure you we are capable of protecting our proposed venture. I never doubted that. But since yesterday, you don't even control your own company. News travels quickly. I just need a little time. It seems your stepbrother has outmaneuvered you. 
You would do well not to underestimate me. You will find out tomorrow what I mean. I look forward to my enlightenment. I'm going to tell your wife everything. What do you mean you need to... What are you doing? I mean it, Jack. Okay, okay, I'll be there. Where are you going? Oh, i got to get out of the warehouse. There's some problem we're going to fix. At 12 o'clock at night? There's not somebody else that can handle it? Come on, Sarah, I'm the boss. Who else is going to do it? I'll be back in an hour. Come on. Jack, I will... Come on, you make that less than an hour. Don't go to sleep. Don't move! Whoa, whoa, wait a minute, easy. You're under arrest. I just got here, I found her this way. Oh, now, come on, wait a minute, I just got here, I just found her. Let's go! Inside. Dameron, your attorney's here. I'm going to make a motion to move your hearing back about two days, and I need a little more time to prepare. Well, I didn't do it. I didn't ask you if... I just want to know why you were there. Who is she to you? We did a few business deals together. Oh. Is that what you were doing at her house? Or were you doing business? What are you 
I'm your lawyer, Jack. Oh, and you're my wife. Well, why don't you pretend I'm not your wife, all right? Try that. I need to know the facts surrounding your relationship with this woman. Why don't you start at the beginning? We were at a trade show at Bataille a few months ago. Uh -huh. We had a few drinks. And? You don't want to hear this. Why don't you fuck what I want to hear and just tell me what happened, all right? Did you sleep with her? Come on, Jack, it's an easy question. Did you fuck her? I think I know you well enough to know that you didn't kill her. <laughs> but I really thought I knew you well enough to know that you wouldn't cheat on me. Jorgen, I wasn't expecting you here. Sorry to barge in on you. We felt that you might need some help securing Bangkok Mercantile. I have something for you. I think you'll find it quite interesting. Hmm. Where'd you get this? Never mind where I got it. What's important is that you use it wisely and to our mutual benefit. This is all I need. Remember, time is of the essence. Yes, yes, of course. Perhaps this will teach you humility. Stubborn, stupid old man. It should never have come to this! Do you hear me? But it did. Now, you know what you must do. Stop it! <laughs> that feels 
is good, right? Right? It's good, huh? They thought I snitched on him to the guards. And speaking, fucking A. Why not? They're all assholes anyway. Besides, snitching's gonna get me out of here on good behavior real soon. Yeah, if you don't get out of the box first. <laughs> anyway, Jack Demon. No shit. Name's Wiley. I've heard about you. You're famous. For a rich puke, you handle yourself pretty well. Where'd you learn that shit? The Dutch told me they would probably approve a million baht because of you. Then we must pay it. To whom do I make out the check? The Department of Finance. is a lie and I'm trying really hard to do the right thing I'm just not sure what that is do you think that killed a girl no he didn't kill her he slept with her mm, he's just got such damn bad timing do you mean? I'm pregnant. And Jack does not know. I just found out. Well, you do what you think is right for the child.
Jack Demmer's attorney. These are his release papers. Hey, what you need is a trip to the body machine. What's the body machine? It's just about the best bar in Bangkok. It's where I hang out. You ought to check it out sometime. <laughs> My attorney says, getting out tonight. That means tomorrow morning, I wake up a free man. <laughs> My dad, you're free to go. Hey, adios, amigo. Hey, don't forget about the body machine. You got it. is that way. So what are we doing? You've been remanded to Papa Fung's custody. That means in order not to violate the terms of your bail, you need to sleep here every night. Oh, Sarah, for Christ's sake. I've already dropped off some of your clothes. If you need anything else, you can just leave word at my office. Well, don't you think we should maybe talk about no, this? No, I think you should get out of the car. What's going on? What the hell is going on? Oh, Jack. I guess no one has told you. I'm chairman now. And under the circumstances, it was inevitable. Oh, it was inevitable, was it? Kind of a boring company, isn't it? Well, I'm sure you'll fix that. Will it be drugs, arms, or maybe your other commodity? <laughs> other commodity? <laughs> This is Asia, Jack. Poor girls here have traded off their virginity for 3,000 years. You'd change that, wouldn't you? So what if she'd make the equivalent of two years' wages in one night? You would rather have her work off those two years in the pennies or in a Bangkok sweatshop for two dollars a day. You're so moral, Jack. You spend your whole life in Asia, yet you understand nothing. Death fights? You're right, I don't understand. Keep an eye on him. Thank you. 
son. I just came from the office. Chang tells me that It was now... decided by the complete board of directors. I'm sorry. That's it? Just like that? Everything my father worked for? Everything you worked for? Damn it, everything I worked for? You'd let it all be destroyed, just like that. Perhaps your brother will change his ways. My brother is nothing but a... You know exactly what he is, and he's not about to change. There's something you're not telling me. There is nothing more to say. No. Now, there's more going on here. I intend to find out what it is. Come on, Jack. It's an easy question. Did you sleep with her? Did you fuck her? who murdered Tiger. <laughs> How much did that cost for a rich man to kill a tiger? Wait, 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 wait. What is it, Farah? You lost your tongue in jail? Or is it your balls? Hey, take it outside. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, why am I coming out of now? Hey, get 
better than that. Hey, come on, man. Give me a break. I only fixed these Let's things. Let's go. You've met Grace. Oh, oh, the cutest. She's your sister Nancy. Uh, this is my. My, this is Mr. Denver. up in the middle of the night whimpering all the time. I don't know what it is. So how'd you get here? Found her on the street. The old straight cat syndrome. I took one look. Couldn't just leave her there. You a mechanic? Now nah, I'm trying to learn. So what's your job? Nothing steady. So where's home? Home? Well, from LA. I ain't got the money to get back there. So I guess this is home. I used to be a Marine. I got discharged in Beirut. Figured I'd take the long way around coming home. Came over here for some I and I. What's I and I? Intercourse and intoxication. It's been a couple of months in an alcoholic haze. Then I was a goner. One thing led to another. Here I am. Uh, let me ask you a question, Mr. Harvard graduate. Okay. Did you kill that girl? No. 
So who killed her? I don't know. But I got one week to find out. You know, when I was in jail, I heard some guy shooting off his mouth about you. He said he knew for a fact that you'd been framed. I don't know, could have been yanking that chain. Why did you get his name? Uh, Mason. Manson. It's a martial arts guy. I think he hangs out with your stepbrother. Hey. you might have some information that could be of interest to me. Possibly. Or do you or don't you? Well, no. You're a businessman, Mr. Damon. What's it worth? Well, what do you want? What is your freedom worth to you? Well, why don't we just try 500 baht? <laughs> is that your bail money? Let's start the negotiations at 500,000. <laughs> you know, I don't like you already. <laughs> Let's go.
Where have you been? One of the cops one. You! You were supposed to sleep at Papa Fung's last night, remember? Where were you? Oh, you really care? I mean, who's speaking now? My wife or my lawyer? Do you understand that there is a warrant out for your arrest? I've got a lead on the man who killed Noi. Good. Then why don't we let the police handle it? Jack, listen to me. I'm trying to build a case for you, and you're just doing stupid things to dig yourself in deeper. What are you looking for? My 38. I threw it away. Oh, for God's sake. Jack, listen to me, please. If you are onto something, then the police are much better equipped to handle it than you are. Just, just stop this macho bullshit. Jack, please don't go. Sarah, I have to bring this guy in. If I tell the police, they probably won't believe me. If they do, they'll blow it anyway. What you looking for, Ma? Maybe. Why'd you kill a girl? Because Master Chan's wishes are my command, sir. So you did murder her? No, not murder. I quest only fame and fortune. And obeying Master Chang bestows this upon me. Oh, you fucking son of a bitch. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Chains got Sarah. I run mention a snake pit. You know where that is? Jack, what do you Jack, mean? That's your brother's place, Jack, for Christ's sakes. Everybody Jack, in Bangkok knows. I never wanted to know. Just where is it? Jack, 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 look. The snake pit. I know the snake pit. I was there. What is it? I know the snake pit. Where is it? <laughs> it, it, it it's in a ruin on the outskirts of town. Look, wait, man. You can't go there. It's a fucking fortress. Wait, I've got some stuff in the truck. Hang, hang on, I'll go get it. <laughs> I'll be back. No. Look, I'll be back. I promise. Please, no, Come on! No.
that's it. What do you mean that's it? That's just a ruined out building. The snake pits in the basement of the building. Good camouflage, huh? Now remember, Wiley, all I need is a diversion. Just keep them occupied. The problem is just what you need. Where the fuck did you get that? It's just some junk I've got to keep, to keep playing around. I said a diversion, not fucking World War Three. That's just what you're gonna get. You get out over here. Go around the building. And I'll give you a signal. Want this? No, I don't need it. Why are you doing this, Chang? Jack has never done anything to hurt you. He's a good man. <laughs> Jack's a dead man. You're very tough. Come on, Chang, you can stop this. You have everything. You have the business now. You have everything you could possibly want. <laughs> no. Not everything.
I allowed certain people to use Bangkok Mercantile as a, as a cover for the transshipment of opium from the Golden Triangle. I was young, desperate for money. Your father found out, put an end to the operation. My partners demanded a meeting with him. I set it up. I never thought they would kill him. <laughs> Listen to him. The old fool accuses me of the very things he once profited from himself. You were no different then than I am now. I have lived with the shame all my life. I'll set you free. Just let it all go, okay? I don't want to live in the past anymore. Because we have got so much. We have got so much to look forward to. The three of us. <laughs> 